Hello everyone, it's uh, Boris Legend here and today I will teach you one of the key things in attack Shielding and shielding can be used in many different ways to dictate the tempo To beat high pressure opponents or to just make all players act like Akin Famwa And there are three main areas to use uh, shielding in attack Let me guide you all forms of shielding are performed with the L2 button or LT on your Xbox controller. The most common form is ground shielding. This will help you to dictate the tempo, wait for teammates to come up in attack and beat high pressure players. Just like you can see in the gamepad camera, I start holding down L2 just before I receive the ball and I keep holding it down to hold the defender off. If necessary I can also move around the left stick while holding down L2. See here are some in-game examples, just uh, holding down L2 and the opponent has uh, no chance taking the ball and this is the last attack in the game and with the help of uh, this shielding technique we can win this game. And here once again a sense you're just holding up uh, Mathieu here just uh, holding down L2 and Mathieu has no chance here against Asensio. Here we have a powerful player like Pogba holding down L2 and the opponent has no chance. You can also move the left stick here and turn around and then make this a wonderful wonderful finish. A great way to use L2 is to combine it with the shooting feint. Benzema here holding down L2 and then just making the shooting feint here and you can see how Benzema gets through and finds a driven pass to score the opening goal in this game. And here once again holding down L2 pushing the defender off and then making the fast uh, tempo switching here with the shooting feint and then eventually scoring this goal. And L2 can be great to use as a last solution when you're about to lose the ball and just hold down L2. Like you can see here also Lewandowski is about to lose the ball but just pressing down L2 and we are able to keep possession of the ball and beat the opponent. What many people forget about is how useful shielding is in air situations. L2 can be used in combination with the left stick to push the defender off while the ball is in the air and win important inches of space to take the ball down. Like you can see in the gamepad camera we are creating ourselves space with L2 while the ball is travelling in the air. This is a great way to use shielding, you can see here Suarez just holding the defender off here, Umtiti in this case and uh, my favorite example Hamsik holding down L2 and without L2 here he's never able to chest the ball down but it's a uh, all thanks to L2 and uh, once again Suarez here, L2 shielding and uh, he's able to chest the ball down here. And here we have Messi holding down L2 and uh, moving the left stick and he's creating himself space here and uh, Felipe Luis has uh, no chance to take the ball. This can be the difference from getting a one versus one situation or losing the ball and here Timing is key. As soon as we see that the defender is getting contact with the player, we bump L2 once. Yes, one time with good timing is perfectly enough. If you press too early or too late, you will have a bigger chance of losing the ball. The only time when it's necessary to spam is when the defender simply doesn't give up. Yes guys, shoulder tackles and timing. A sensor here, he has a small body but he's strong here. Perfect timing with L2 and here Nainggolan as soon as we see defender is getting close, he's getting contact, BAM! We have the L2 bump here and he has no chance and here Benzema against Ramos, perfect timing with L2 and uh, he just uh, throw one of the strongest defender in the game off here and we have the chance to score and eventually Neymar will score this goal. And here we have Mkhitaryan, perfect timing and uh, Casemiro can only feel Mkhitaryan's muscle is here because we have such a good timing with LT, we bump it once and we find Pogba here to score the goal and the uh, only time when it's necessary to spam it is when the defender simply doesn't give up. Like you can see here, Koulibaly doesn't give up but we keep spamming and we get through. Guys, when you master these uh, three parts of shielding you will be able to control the game much better and also create more chances and the opponent, instead of smelling more goals, he will only be able to smell your ass. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did so and found it helpful, please make sure to drop a like and also subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching and as always, until next time.